This morning I'm looking at the uh, development of some osmotic blisters on the bottom of a boat. She's about 15 years old and she hasn't got that many but the ones that have developed have been quite large and uh, on cleaning out you can see that the outer chop strand mat has developed some wicking. If you've only got a few blisters sometimes the best way to do it is to grind out the whole area around it back to the sound uh, woven roving says in this case behind it fresh water flush over a period of time and then epoxy fill if the rest of the hull has got more osmotic problems sometimes it's best to either slurry blast or peel and hop back and then reinstate uh, the moisture content in this area is actually quite high so again it's important to ensure the boat is kept dry inside just as much as uh, protecting the outer coatings sometimes I've found that the osmotic issues that I've seen have come from high moisture content in the bilges that have never been properly pumped dry